You probably live as a free person in a free society. And because of that, you have difficulty understanding what it's like to be a person in slavery. This type of comprehension is even more difficult for a people who were once free if they come to find themselves living in a society where they are now slaves. Try to imagine what it would be like to be sitting around a campfire at night, living in another country that you have been carried away to, and you wonder, how did this happen? The children of Israel were taken into captivity after a brutal siege on their land. And this siege was so horrible, so horrific, that even if they had not gone into captivity after the siege, their lives still would have been changed horribly. Because during the siege, they got so hungry that they actually resorted to cannibalism. The siege of their land alone would have been enough to give them nightmares that were worse than those suffered by just about any soldier who has ever suffered from PTSD. But the suffering of the Israelites continued even after the siege, as rings were placed in their ears and noses for chains to connect them together like animals, as they were forcibly taken to another country. During their captivity, as they asked the question, why are we slaves in this foreign land, there was a man who they knew was a prophet in their midst. And this prophet was trying to explain to them the causes of their misery. His name was Ezekiel. And Ezekiel explained to the Israelites that the reason for their captivity was, among other things, their sin of idolatry. Yes, as the nation of God, their identity was supposed to be God, but instead they worshiped false idols. At the Ronald L. Dart Evangelistic Association, we have a message that clearly shows the sins of the Israelites are very similar to the sins being committed by mankind today. These sins that got Israel taken into captivity are clearly being practiced by most people today. The title of this message by Ron Dart is Identity or Idolatry. It's free. You can find this message on the audio recordings tab of our website, rldea.com. Again, that's Identity or Idolatry at rldea.com.